All right, so this is a suggestion via a donation. The name of the song is Behind the Painted Smile, uh, featuring Low Key by the artist Akala. Uh, listen, if you are new here, please like and subscribe. The more that you like this content, the more that I know that you specifically would like to see more of this specific type of content, okay? Um, let's go ahead and just jump into this immediately, guys. Let's go ahead and check this out. Uh, we have the lyrics pulled up just in case we need them also. So what are we going to give them now? Uh... We got a little song together that we'd like to share with you. Once I move this mic out of the way. Yeah. Yo, if you know it. Yo. All right, super solid piano. Yo. Will you please stand up oh. in the air? Behind my pain, smile on all the revolutionary noise. It's nothing but a lost little boy, confused and insecure. Arrogant and overshore, and egotistical prick. So come on, please praise me more. It's great if my music bettered you, but I contemplate murder every day. Though don't put me on a pedestal. Plus, truly, just the vehicle, the music just runs through me. In my better moments, I could let the universe use me. But I'm a smile, this gym. Murder every day, though don't put. I love the fact that he says. Be, like for example the painted smile the concept of um um in a sense code switching or, or being who you are to different people being who you really are to different specific groups of people potentially that's the art of code switching or being or being hidden behind your painted smile um or even um it could be the pers the the persona you put on to the public um everyone sees you as this one thing potentially right but in all actuality you're a different entity this uh, as, i think that's a I think everyone on this planet has somewhat of a painted smile, um, you know, never, never exactly showing, you know, who you are internally to the public in, in fear of being um, disregarded, right? Pushed aside. Um, so, yeah, he just blatantly says, listen, behind my painted smile, when uh, when all the revolutionary noise is nothing. That's, that that doesn't actually make any sense, guys. The, the lyrics. Okay, wait. That's not. I'm pretty sure that's not what he said. All right, <laughs> the lyrics are wrong. All right. Um, behind his painted smile and all the revolutionary noise, there's nothing but a lost little boy. Right, is what I heard, or something similar to it. Right. Um, respect, guys. Absolutely respect. That that bar. Let's get it. Praise my boy, it's great if my music bettered you, but I contemplate murder every day. Though don't put me on a pedestal. Plus, truly, just the vehicle, the music just runs through me. In my better moments, I could let the universe use me. Behind my smile, there's generations of pain, self hatred engraved, miseducated my brain, decimated the place where my dead relations were slain. Not just. Okay, we're starting this again, Loki. I, I love Loki, bro. Let's talk your shit, bro. Physically but mentally penetrated our veins. What you got inside hasn't got a die once. It could die a lot of times. That I promise my son analyze every song that I have done. Trying to fight colonialism with a colonized tongue. Shit. Oh. You know the words on the city. Hook is crazy, guys. I'm be honest. I didn't expect anything less than than this from them. Be honest. Behind my painted smile is the most painful grimace. This mental prison I live in because I am so conditioned. All right. By my privilege, what a strange contradiction. To grow brown and Britain and know that you're living was painful by a carcass that resembles yours. Born in the heart of the empire, you're worth more than others just like you, but less than the native ones. Raised by my mum, but in this world, I am my father's son. Behind my painted smile, we're very flawed human beings. Done many things that oh I regret and never knew the reason. What do you believe in truth and freedom or are you deceiving? I don't, don't want to die in prostration to Europeans. They say the answer is within you when nowhere else. Understand the vision, man on the mission to know himself. No defendants, no retreat and no surrender. You probably think that we don't remember Ota Benga. First of all, the knowledge, the, the historical knowledge that Loki just dropped, Odabenga. I'm not going to speak on it because I, I like for people to research their own, on their own time, right? 
Um, look at uh, Otabenga in um, correlation to the Bronx Zoo. All right, let's go. Get it. Behind my pain is small, it's the most painful frown. Picture in the buckets of blood that decorate the town. The trigger gun, bullet sung, gun some, and everyone is dead. Was somebody, someone behind my pain is small? I feel Ooh, like I'm only buckets of blood that decorate the town. The trigger gun, bullet sung, gun some, and everyone is dead. Was somebody, someone behind my pain is hold on, hold on, hold on, jump. Is this like a, a slang? Because I can't, I can't think of the context of that. Trigger, jum, bullets, sung. Hmm. Jum. I know jum is a, or, or, I think it's Arabic for, for like, a, hmm. Sunrise? Night? No, not night. <clears throat> Maybe day. Maybe day. Um, all right. Day bullets, sung. Sung, gun some, and everyone is dead. Was great the town. The trigger drum, bullet sung, gun some, and everyone is dead. Was somebody, someone behind my painted smile? I feel like a naked child. Maybe rapping it for now, cause the passion is fading now. Up early though, I search and roam along this dirty road. Just another traveler taking a long journey home. Always talk of Bro, I hope, I hope you're not, you don't call yourself a traveler in hip hop. Loki belongs in hip hop. To protect them, what is the intention? Same as it ever was the colonial past the present. Got more respect for most of the right wingers than the paternalistic patronizing liberal bigger. Our way of life is so divine. The thing about the concept of being a right winger, right? Um, and being a liberal, it's, a, it's an interesting phenomenon because they're kind of the same thing. Only difference is the right wingers say their shit. You, you know who? How do you explain it? They say their shit to your face. The liberals say it behind your back. You get what I mean? So which one is better? Do you want the 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 constant punches in your face, or do you want to not get the punches in your face, but still get the the the, the same hit, levels of hatred in a sense? Um, it's the same shit, guys. Right, it's just, um, yeah, let's go. And we should intervene, select war and export the British dream. Behind cinema screen, there's much that isn't seen. George Clooney war movies never bring our Yo, children fam, peace. You ever wake up and just feel like fucking off? Never coming back to this place and just cutting off all the time. Oh. The concept of like, he's saying that the, like the, the British, um, like the British way of life potentially and the American dream are lies. That's basically what he's saying. Um, Ooh, I can't, I can't like speak on the British way of life at all. Zero chance I could do that, guys. But the American dream in, in itself is, mm, if you are raised, for example, I think this is how it works in America, um, or I can like, I can honestly explain this in a way that's intelligent, maybe. In America, where you're from kind of means a lot because that means that's going to be what you see and what you've grown up around. For example, in America, someone who looks like me but doesn't have the same education as me, right? Or like have the right connections or the same family, for example, will not under any circumstance share my, my experience in America, right? They just will not, right? So the concept of the American dream is valid depending on who you are. Like the concept of buying a house and by having a car and having what two point what was that average two point five kids or some, some weird number like that, um, or having like having your your son and your daughter and your fence and your cars and your front and backyard. That's when I hear that as that's kind of like the American dream, and that's it's in a sense it's viable for some, right? Um, but then it's not viable for others, purely based on where geographically they're from within our borders, right? Because um, we need to come to the realization that all all states in America are not created equal. And that's an that's an unfortunate thing. Um, you know, like for example, if you're if you're from the East Coast, from the Northeast Coast, 
you're probably going to you can you're most likely going to live the American dream depending on where but for the most part you're better off financially um, than almost everywhere else in the country even if for example someone poor in New York is absolutely rich anywhere else they go for the most part kind of right because like for example people are living in very like in New York City they they're living in very like not amazing neighborhoods but being able to pay you know $5000 a month okay they can go to let's say <laughs> um i don't know Georgia Atlanta and get an entire house like a massive like five bedroom house their own land right for $1500 and then have all that extra money left over. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? So it it's all depends on, on where you are and where you plan on going. The American dream is is definitely viable, but it all dep but it just depends on where you're from, and that's the sad thing. So it's not I wouldn't say that's the it's, it's not technically equal, no, um, because that's just the way shit is. Unfortunately, um, I would like for everyone to experience these things, but uh, until for example, in America, until we can um, make it so local property taxes stop paying for the schools, that would probably change the entire country in America. Because if no one owns property in that area, your taxes are going to be really low. So your school is going to be absolutely terrible. But then if you look at areas where no one is renting and everyone owns their property, guess what? Their schools are amazing. You see, it's where you're from. Um, because America is really good at creating economic deserts, education deserts, food deserts. All right. Um, and if that if I can attribute that to potentially um, Britain, then but I can't I can't I don't have that life experience. You know what I mean? But um. If that's the case, then sorry, guys, if that's the case, I, I you know, I, I definitely um, I definitely feel bad for that. Um, I wish there was something that we could all do. Yes. To to make it so everyone can, in a sense, live a equal opportunity. You get what I mean? Um, but for America, I can definitely tell you fix the taxes, pay for the school, local taxes, pay for the school. And you'll fix everything. Trust me in America. Um, but Britain, I don't know. Let's go. Almost did last year. The trouble was the bloody cops had me running in and out of bloody duck. I've been there, brother. Don't want, don't promote it in this rap shit. I ain't a stranger to having my back on, on. This guy that's right behind Loki currently is um, a guy that was in his music video. Um recently plastic can't keep us captive we see the tactics that i saw at this we beat the fascists release the classics and reach, reach the, the masses, masses. london city let's see everybody make some noise the hook is crazy guys let's look at them Danny. catch these people Danny. london make some noise for real hip-hop music make some noise for my homeboy loki yeah loki is an absolute beast on the microphone guys Thank you. super solid message he's so consistent with it you know what I mean absolutely guys just let it run out <laughs> oh they have a no 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 Akala has an album 10 years of Akala interesting um, alright yeah listen no complaints on this song at all, guys. I mean, as expected, we expected something deep, something thought-provoking, message-heavy within the song, and they obviously delivered that, guys. Um, let me know in the comments the next one of these from them. I should be listening to either of them, and I will get to it as soon as I possibly can. All right? And to listen. You guys all have an amazing day. Enjoy it thoroughly. All right?